hi everybody uh, welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here my name is caroline in today's video i'll be sharing with you guys my morning routine as a mom of two so i usually get up before everybody else and i start off by making a smoothie for myself uh, since it's frozen fruits, I'm just gonna get them ready and wait for them to defrost before I make my smoothie. If you're new here, I am a mom of two. I recently had a baby boy who is two months now. And it took me two years and two kids to learn how important self-care is. Uh, one month after baby number two, I started feeling exhausted, sad, and I didn't feel okay about it because i have a toddler who relies on me uh so the second thing that i do is work out i've learned that to be there for my kids fully i have to take care of myself as well and that's when i decided to start my self-care journey and so far i feel happy as a mom and wife i feel fulfilled at the end of the day I started planning my days a little bit better and yeah I feel like I'm doing great uh we're starting this year really good and on a high note so yeah I recently read a book and uh it said that self-care doesn't need to be something super long it is the little things that we do on a daily basis that are planned and intentional like skincare reading a book just small things taking care of your nails getting nail polish removing nail polish just the little things that matter a lot to you after working out i take a quiet long shower and this makes me feel really good fresh and ready uh, to start the day be there for my kids and play with them and just full of energy so for me to be able to do this it has come with its own sacrifice i have to get up a little bit earlier than everybody but it has been so worth it before i started doing this i felt very unproductive because i'll wake up at seven with everybody else mostly my kids and once they're up it's breakfast time and then playing time nap time and most of the time one kid naps the other one doesn't and the one who doesn't i spend time with them because i'm not gonna leave them just by themselves because they're young and uh by the time it's time to go to bed i'm fully exhausted i can't do anything i'm very tired and i end up going to bed as well so this was making me feel really bad and sad because i never had time for myself and i thought for a long time how i'll get myself together and i realized that if i took only an hour before the kids get up to take care of me that was going to be important so after shower i read a book this is a recent book that i'm reading raising good humans i got it from amazon and it's very inspirational and has very good tips and points uh, for a new mom for any person for caretaker guardian uh, who's in, who's taking care of kids i used to love planning like writing down the things that i plan to do in a day and then when i became a mom that all went out the window so i recently got back into that and it's been amazing so in my planner i have three things or four that i must do on a daily basis and that's working out taking care of my skin taking a shower and reading a book uh, the last thing that i do is get my breakfast ready so today i'm having a bagel an orange and a yogurt so at this point everybody is waking up and we're all gonna have breakfast as a family and yeah i'm ready to start my day thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next one bye bye